How's everyone? Welcome to the live edition here on Monday. So what we're gonna do is gonna give you a second to get set up because we need a chair. So grab one of those, you can use your couch if you're at home. And when we kind of get halfway through the workout, we're gonna need something that you'll you want to be able to slide over and back on. Now it's not absolutely necessary, but ideally somewhere where you can slide over and back. So if you're in your socks and you can slide out a piece of your floor at home, great. Um, if you're really stuck, I'll be able to come up with an alternative. You do not need uh, any weights, but uh, two bottles of water like we've been using. I'll just grab my bottles of water here. We'll be using them later on in the workout. Okay, so we'll be using these later on. Um, so go grab those if you, if you need to get them. They're about a liter each, but anywhere between half a liter and a liter will work. Okay, we don't want them too heavy because the exercise we're going to be doing is quite tough. Um, that's all we need, I believe. Uh, make sure that your chair is safe. All right, so my guy is going nowhere. He's not going to slide. I've got some dumbbells here to keep him in position. Um, and when we're ready to go, then we'll get into a warm up. So, first thing we're going to do is just bounce up and down the feet like we're skipping. We're gonna have four blocks today. Usually we have three blocks. Okay, so today we're gonna to have four blocks. All right, we're gonna go high knee. Swap my legs. High knee. Grab that knee. Put it up towards your chest. We're gonna go airplane. So hinging into this. Hands out. Airplane. Down. Back up. Hands out, airplane. There you go. You can put that leg on the floor when you come in here if you need to. Let's do three on each side. Working on the hamstrings here, trying to keep the body nice and straight all the time. Use the arms for balance. Here we go. We'll do side to side. Just lunge to the side, stretch in the groin. Just over and back for a couple. So the first one, we're going to have a Bulgarian split squat, all right? So I'm going to demo here. So we're going to go one leg back here. If this is really hard, just go split squat like this, okay? But if you're able, put up here, and we're going down and coming back up, all right? So when we go down, we can use the opposite arm like so, all right? So if that right leg is not in front, the left hand can come up. And if you're really good, we're going to do a couple of jumps. Go and save the other side. Okay, half we go. So this is still part of a warm up, but this is going to be one of the first exercises that we do. Okay, you're going to be working for 20 seconds in each leg, and then we're going to swap over into a push up. All right, so we're going to go down here now. A couple of push ups for the warm up. Push up, and let's just get a rotation in. Push up, rotation. Okay, we're going to be doing 20 seconds work on the push ups as well. So you pick. A set of push-ups or a style of push-ups that suits you. If you want to go from the knees, go from the knees. If you want to go from the toes, go from the toes. If you even want to go here, do a couple of push-ups from here. Make it really hard. You can do that as well. So pick whichever one works for you. All right. So second one. I'm going to show you the second uh, set of exercises just so that you know what's coming. All right. So what we've got is a step up. But it's a jumping step up like this. Okay, if that's really tough, just step up, step up, step up, step up like so. Okay, my shoes are really clean, so just make sure your shoes are clean if you're stepping on your couch or your chair at home. So that's gonna be that one. Go quickly through it if you're able to go quickly through it. Start off slowly with that because it requires a good bit of strength in the, in the calves. If you're going to spring off the floor, all right, so just pay particular attention to that. Start really slow with the step up if that's tough. And then we've got a, a T and a Y, so T's and Y, it's still part of a warm up. T's and Y's, thumbs up all the time. Okay, we're hinging over, we've got our back straight, all right, and then we're coming up in a Y position, coming up in a T position. And this is where we can use our weight, okay? So we go, T, Y, all right? 
So what we've got in the first block is lower body, upper body. Second block, lower body, upper body. Third block is kind of a, it's kind of more posterior focus, so it is lower body. And then we've got mountain climbers, which incorporate a lot of muscles. And then finally, then we've got a bit of core and a squat finisher, okay? So we've got four blocks today. It's gonna to be a 20 second and 10 second half. So, give you an example here now. When we start working into this, we're gonna go 20 seconds on the right, 20 on the left. We're gonna do 20 seconds push-ups. We're gonna repeat that three times. Okay, so we have three rounds in each. All right, when we get to the second round, then I'll explain how it's gonna work. That 10 second rest is literally just enough time to get from one station to the next. So we're gonna go in about 30 seconds, all right? So I'll give you time to, if you wanna grab some water, if you wanna put on some music, fire on some music, I'm gonna leave it noiseless here, as hopefully you can hear me. And um, as I said, make sure your chair is safe and whatnot, okay? So with each of these, again, start off with maybe the easier version to make sure you're comfortable if you're new here, but if you're well used to it, try a progression. So for example, I'm gonna start off with the, with these guys, with the jumps, and then I'm just gonna go into regular repetitions after that as I get tired, all right? So we'll count you down, we'll give you 10 seconds. Three, two, one, off we go. So we've got 20 seconds work on this leg. If we can, we're getting up into the air, leaving the ground. 10 seconds in. Using the opposite arm to give myself some elevation. Three, two, one. Swapping over. That one's tough. Five seconds. Three, two, one. Half we go. So most important thing is just find a position that works for you. All right. If I can come in really close and I'm comfortable with it, some of us might have to go further. We don't have the range of the ankle. Five seconds. Three, two, one, and rest. Woo. Okay, 10 seconds off. We have 20 seconds of push ups. Just see what works for you. You ready? Try and get at least 10 reps in. Off we go. Good. 10 seconds in. Try and make them good repetitions. Three, two, one, and rest. Okay, good stuff. So we're straight back into that right leg. All right, so if you got two jumps on this first, on that first one, off we go. Maybe we're just one reps in this one. Try and stay nice and upright. Try not to wobble left and right. As you're doing it, we should be nice and warm now. Two, one, and swap. Lovely. So that's really focusing on the quads. Are you ready? Three, two, one, off we go. Again, it's opposite arm, opposite leg. So if my left leg is out in front, when I go down, right leg comes up. Five seconds. Three, two, one, and rest. So I'm going to stick out the legs. Quads are burning. We got one more of those, okay? Push up, second round. Three, two, one, off we go. I'll keep going, I'll keep going. Go from the knees if you need to, or even bend at the hips. All right, but always keep the nose in front of the fingers. Three, two, one, and rest. All right, here we go. Last one here, quads should be burning. All right, you might feel it on your glute as well if you've got a really wide stance. Off we go. All right, so either the glute or the quad. If you're doing the jumping version, like me, you're probably feeling it on the quad. Five seconds. Three, two, one, and switch. Lovely, last one here. Woo. Should be nice and warm. Three, two, 
One, off we go. So try and get down as low as we can. Up to the arm, up to the leg. Five seconds. Three, two, one. And rest. Good job, guys. Okay, shake out the legs. Woo! Quads are full of blood. Are we ready? Three, two, one. Off we go. Last 20 seconds here. As many as we can. Five, four, three, two, one, and rest. Good job, guys. Well done. Okay, first round done. Take a breather. Shake out the chest. All right, so I'm going to go back here. Thumbs facing backwards. Hands up. Kind of stretching my pecs. Just to loosen them out after those push-ups. All right. So next one. We've got two minutes off now, guys. Okay, so whatever you need to do, if you need to get set up for the next one, we're going to be on. So I'm pushing into the chair. All right, so with this leg, I'm pushing into the chair. Push, 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 push. The majority of the force going through that front leg, okay? Trying to elevate ourselves up into the air. After that, we got our T and our Y. So we're working on the back here, right? So we're here. Our T and our Y. When you're doing this, when we bend over, try and get our chest nice and close to the floor. Okay, we don't want to be up here like this, doing our T and our Y. Okay, we want to be bent over. You might feel a stretch in the hamstrings back here. That's okay. Whew. All right, we got another 30 seconds and we're going to go. All right, so cutting down the rest a little bit in between these. And again, this water bottle I think is a little bit heavier. Go. Hopefully those water bottles are the same. Okay. We're going 10 seconds. All right, so we got these ones first of all on the chair. We're working for 20, we're back into this. We got four of each, are we ready? Three, two, one after we go. So pushing into the chair. Okay, if that's tough, again, you're just on a step up. I recommend starting with a step up, just like this. My chair is a little funny. Two, one, and rest. I recommend starting with that step up, okay? And then progressing on if you're able. All right, you need to be fairly light to do the other one. Three, two, one, off we go. If we go for five T's, five Y's. Five seconds. And miss. All right. Okay, back into this guy. My chair is a little bit slippery, so I'm gonna keep the double in. Ready? Yeah, we go. So again, just go and step up. We'll try and power through if you can, all right? Blast up with the top leg. That's the one that's doing the work. And if you're able, nice and quick, alternating, like so. Five, four, three, two, one, and switch. Okay, so that's a lot easier. Should be a lot easier than the Bulgarians. All right, similar movement pattern. Off we go. I'm gonna start with a Y this time. Y's are usually a little bit harder than the T's. So, if you find them really hard, just stay on the T's, all right? I'm doing five and five. All right, we got five more. Two, three, four, five, and rest. Okay, you ready? Five seconds. Three, two, one, off we go. We're over halfway now. Pushing, driving down into the chair, the couch, whatever we're working on. Three, two, one, and rest. 
start nice and long. Again, that one requires a good bit of ankle strength. So stay on the step up if it's getting tough. Off we go. Wise into T's. Okay, again, chest towards the floor. All right, this is where we want to be. Five, three, two, one, and rest. Okay, really healthy for the shoulders, those two, all right? Last one here. Again, stay on a step up if you need to. Three, two, one, off we go. So I'll just finish off just with that step up. Again, focusing on using the top leg each time, okay? And again, it's opposite arms. Push with that top leg. And then when you get good, put more force up into the air. Make sure your chair doesn't slide. There we go, and rest. Okay, last one here now. And off we go. Five. And onto our T's. Two. Three, four, five, into a white. One, two, three, four. Last one. Five, and take a breather. Job, guys. Hold on, hold on. Take a rest, okay? We got about a minute and a half off. Shake out the upper body, shake out the legs again. Right, next one. We're going to need something to slide, okay? So I'm just going to pop off. Um, actually, do you know what? I'll, I'll grab something here just to demo for you. So if you're on a surface like I am and you're in your shoes, all right, grab yourself like a pair of socks or a hat or something, okay? Leave these here on the floor. I'm gonna pop my heels on them. And you'll see, I'll be able to slide over and back, okay? So there's my slide. So what we're gonna be doing is, we're gonna be doing a leg curl like this, where we're here, bridging up. We can put the palms on the floor. So this is easiest. Harder, hardest, okay? We're going to go double leg, out, back in. Try and keep those hips up all the time. Try not to let the hips drop. So hips up all the time. Here we go. All right, that's our leg curl. All right, we're just going to be doing double, all right? If you're really good, you can do single. But for the purpose of this day, we're going to be doing double, okay? That's the first one. And then with that, we're doing our mountain climbers. Now, we've done these ones before. All right, so you're either going straight up or you're going out to the side. Those ones out to the side, they're really tough, okay? So we're alternating between those two. It's 20 on, 10 off, and we're doing four of each, all right? So we, what we got, what we got? We got 30 seconds, all right? So again, if these guys are really tough, all right, all I want you to do is just bridge up. If that's tough enough, just bridge up there, all right? Or maybe just come out a little bit and come back in. Out a little bit and come back in, all right? That's all I want you to do. If you don't have something to slide on, just bridge up and just march left and right like that. We ready? Three, two, one, off we go. So we were targeting the quads a little bit earlier on. Now we're working on the hamstrings. All right, so that Bulgarian split squat was really quad dominant. This one's really hamstring dominant. And rest. All right, them hammers are gonna be burning at the end of this, we're ready. Five seconds. Three, two, one, half we go. Twenty seconds work to do. Ten left. Six, five, four, three, two, one, and rest. So really kicking those feet out as far as we can. All right. Come straight on with you here. Are you ready? Three, two, one, off we go. Again, if they get really tough, just stick with the bridges, okay? So you might want to just stick here. Bridge, bridge. Three, two, one, and rest. Okay, my hammers now are starting to really feel it. If you get a cramp on them, just jump straight into a stretch. Are we ready? Three, two, one, off we go. Five, 
five, four, three. Regular mountain climbers if you're really struggling and rest. Good job guys, okay. Really good. So again, if they're really tough, these ones, just bridge here for me, all right? And then just go walks, okay? Or maybe you wanna just come out to here and bridge. Are we ready? Three, two, one, off we go. You might even wanna just go here and back, okay? You don't have to go all the way out. All right, I'm going right the way out. So I feel comfortable doing that. Keep working now, keep working. We got five seconds. Three, two, one, and rest. Go only out one more. If that's catchy, look, jump back here. Stretch the hammer in between. All right, if you're starting to get a little bit of a cramp. Ready, half we go. So just regular mountain climber, half we go. 20 seconds work. Regular if we need to. All right, if you're able, drive those feet and those knees out to the side. Five seconds. Three, two, one, and rest. Last one here now, guys, okay? We get a stretch in the hamstring straight after this. Three, two, one, off we go. Even if you just gotta go out slowly, relax, come back in. It's another way of doing it as well, all right? Bridge it up, out, down, bridge up, out, down. One more, up, out, down, lovely. All right. Ready, three, two, one, as many as you can, now go. Out to the side if you're able. 10 seconds. Four, three, two, one, and rest. Good job, guys. Okay, we're over on our back. Straight away, over on our back. All right, let's grab the back of one leg. Straighten them out. Just up and back for a couple of reps. Loosen out the hamstrings. They're bound to be tight after that. We got two minutes off before our next one. All right, this is the last one. We're gonna be doing a bird dog. So we're gonna be on our back here. All right, we're gonna be working for about 30 seconds. All right. So bird dog. The variation we're gonna be doing is here, opposite arm, opposite leg, pushing these together, okay? So the harder I push these two together, the more challenging it's gonna be. So back is flat against the ground, pushing the two of these together. And then from here, I'm going with the opposite arm, opposite leg. Push those together, harder I push, harder I push this up and this down, the harder it is, okay? So we're gonna work for 15 seconds on the right, 15 seconds on the left. After that, we're up, and we're going into squats. Now, I'm gonna give you a variation, all right? Similar to the Bulgarian split squats, we can start off with a jump, and then progress back into just a full depth squat. The idea is, gotta feel the burn in the legs, okay? It's gonna be three rounds of each of these, so three, Rounds of the core, three rounds of the legs, we're done after this. Okay, so this is our finisher. All right. All right, we got 30 seconds where we're going. So grab some water. When does it say dead bug? Dead bug. Did I say a bird dog? Dead bug. Thank you, Brenda. We have to get Brenda on here doing some core work for everyone, doing a plank challenge or something. <laughs> Let's see, you know, that might go on for about half an hour, 40 minutes on its own, like, you know. Thank you, Brenda, yes, dead bug. Okay, we ready? So we're gonna start off with the uh, squats, all right, because they're gonna be really tough. All right, gotta go blow up, good blow up with those, all right, so it's only 30 seconds. We got 10, nine. So start with a jump if you're able, and then go back into that deep squat. Three, two, one, off we go. So when I go down and bring my hands up in front, makes it easier to get a little lower, keep the chest upright. We're halfway there. If we need to, back into your regular squat. 10 seconds. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and rest. Good job, guys. Okay, straight away down in here. Are we ready? Three, two, one, off we go. Our dead bug. 
Pressing that lower back into the ground. Pushing the hand and knee together. Four, three, two, one. Swap sides. Same thing, straight away, off we go. So, as the arm goes back, the leg comes back, and they come in together. Three, two, one, and rest. Okay, we're straight away up again. Are we ready? Three, two, one, half we go. Good job. Keep going now, keep going. Ooh. Halfway there. Three, two, one, and rest. Good job, guys. That was round two. We ready? Three, two, one, off we go. Press that lower back into the ground. Drive the knee and hand together. Five seconds. Three, two, one, stop over. Lower back pressed into the ground. Knee and hand together. The harder you push them together, and rest. The harder it is. Okay, last round now. Oh, legs are jelly. Five seconds. Three, two, one, half we go. Oh, there's my 10 jump and squats. Lovely, 15 seconds. Five, four, three, two, one, and rest. Good job, guys. Last one here now. Ooh. Legs are jelly. Three, two, one, off we go. Squeeze the lower back, push it into the ground, and swap. Push the hand and knee together. We want to make it a bit harder, you can even lift the head off the ground. Three, two, one, and rest. Good job, guys. Take a breather. Grab some water. We're done for the day. Good finisher there. Okay, we're gonna cool down, then we'll do a bit of a stretch. So first thing is you shake out the legs, all right? If you're still with me, just shake out the legs. All right, just a quick quad stretch. So you're gonna be full of blood after that. Quick quad stretch each side. Shake them out. Hands straight. Just a little sweep through here as I go down. I'm getting a stretch and then hammer on the back of the leg each time. Okay? We'll just stay tall. Move inside to side, stretch on the inside of the thigh. Good job, guys. Well done. Down here on the floor, we're in this 90. 90, 90, 90 position. Hand out here in front, reaching through. We'll get a bit of rotation here on the spine. Up, rotate back as far as we can. And we get a stretch in the glute. Try and keep this opposite shoulder solid here. All right, I'm gonna rotate back. So try not to cave in all like this. Okay, try and keep it very solid. Back in where it is, last one. Reach through. I right, we feel that in between the shoulder blades. When we rock back, again, 90, 90, 90, hand here, reaching through, we get a stretch here in the hip. And then as we come back like this, in between the shoulder blades, usually let the head follow the hand. Reaching through here, up we go, rotate. Reaching through, up, head follows the hand. 
Try you a little further each time. Reaching through the last one. Up we go. Lovely guys. Just gonna go here. Just pull those thumbs back. If you can remember the feeling when we did this after the push-ups. Chest might have been a little bit tighter. We just go here, let the hand up, rotate back as far as we can. Up, rotate back. Try to make as big a circle as we can, keep on the hand as close to the body as we can. Good job guys, well done, well done. Okay, that's our session done for today. Hope you enjoyed it, Shelby's here tomorrow. We are working on a couple of things for you. Hats, do I have a hat that's here summer? Hats are going on sale soon. Again, we just have a few logistical things to figure out. And um, again, all the don all the profits are will be going towards a uh, COVID-19 cause. So I hope you're having a good week. Hope you're enjoying the nice weather. And we will see you, hello, we'll see you on Wednesday. If you have any questions, leave us know. Salam.